I was asked to speak for just a minute without hesitation, repetition, or repetition. <laughs> and looked at the paintings. There's true art, there's true talent in there. I wish I had enough money to, if I had a, a room big enough for, where's that wonderful one over there? I mean, what about that? Uh, that is a, a true work of art. It's a, it's a fantasy world. It's coming straight from the world of the imagination. Everybody has something to say, some way to express themselves. And art is, of course, a wonderful opportunity because in, not, in painting, you get rid of a lot of the emotions which are distressing you or tying you up. And I've been or seen them, their connection there, and uh, it, it was quite, it was most inspiring. I slept rough for uh, nearly two years this last time. Uh, I was also um, a rough sleeper as a teenager. Um, listening to me, you might think, well, she's very different to how we would perceive the average rough sleeper to be. There are common threads that run through um, the, the lives of people who end up in situations like that. I turned the corner when I realised that about myself. Um, so it's interesting being here and seeing the people and the um, media and art group was instrumental in helping me turn my life around. For anyone that understands about the causes of rough sleeping, you, whether I get through to you with this or not, this is the sharp end of rough sleeping. It's not having, not having a roof over your head. It's the fact that you don't have relationships in your life. The fact that you don't care about anything. You can put a roof over someone and maybe you don't understand why people keep walking out and abandoning these places and you see the same faces time and time again. If you don't give people a reason to want to keep a home, they will always be homeless, even if you put them uh, within four walls. Giving people slowly a reason to think outside, a, a purpose outside simply going to soup runs and, and filling the hours of their day, but giving them something to believe in again, really.